All right, so this is a long overdue video. Uh, the Magnus very generously sent me a lot of great stuff from Sweden many moons back. And I looked at some of it, but uh, there's still some things that I haven't gotten to. And the girls have offered to help me check out this stuff. You want to say hi, girls? YOLO! <gasps> And here's what we're going to be taking a look at. Does that look familiar at all? No. no. Alright, I guess it's been longer than I thought since <laughs> we got this. Uh, so yeah, Magnus sent this quite a while ago. And um, we actually, we did take a look at this, the Yule Scum, yeah. back around Christmas, which shows how long it's been. And since then I did do a video with a bunch of Swedish foods, like um, I guess kind of uh, traditional Swedish treats. And uh, there's still some more stuff left over though. So. I still have to look at this 24-hour ration, but don't worry girls, that's not what we're doing today. Yeah. <gasps> and the only other thing left is the treats, which somebody's obviously spotted one of these. Alright, so here they are without the box. You can see we get some prepackaged stuff here, and we have this one mystery bag. This is the one thing that could be a problem because it has been quite a few months since I got this, and these are actually loose candies. You know what, actually... Let's go ahead and take a look at them at least. Let's see what we got. How's it smell? Chocolatey. It smells pretty good. <laughs> well, this one over here actually has a cold, so she can't smell anything, but uh, it still smells like candy, so that's a good thing. How does that look? It looks like yummy. That's just like oh it's like I want to eat the whole thing. It's like I, it's like I just came back from Halloween night. Yeah. yeah, I guess there's all kinds of different things in here, but uh, we'll, we'll check these out too. But let's see what the other things are too. All right, let's see. Can you guys read some of these things? Yeah, got and blend that. Got and um, blend that salt. It means a uh, good variety, something like that. Uh, and there's another one here. This is like the same thing, but instead of salt, it's yeah, original. I don't know how you'd say that in, in Swedish, but uh, basically these are like licorice, licorice treats, licorice candies. And these are sweet ones, and these are salted ones. So we're gonna see what you guys think of these, okay? And we also have salt scum. Salt scum. Uh, this is, the scum is actually um, foam, is what it means. And these are actually going to be like the uh, Yule scum that we had. I don't know if you remember having that around Christmas time. I do. Okay. These were good. The only problem was they, they kind of like break your teeth. Not because they're hard, but because they're um, they're like so chewy that it's kind of hard to bite them when you're pulling them out with your teeth. It's, uh, yeah, I don't know, it's just really chewy. So anyway, this is a um, sweet and a salty scum or foam. So we have those. And then the last thing is... It means milk chocolate? Yes. Oh. Yep. Marabou milk chocolate. That's a pretty easy thing. We'll probably save that for last because these are the, these are a little bit more mysterious and that's pretty obvious what it is. I'm picking up some Swedish. Yeah, yeah, there you go. Alright, now let's go ahead and try these out, right? Yeah. I'm sure that's what you guys are ready to do. Okay, let's try these out. Uh, what do we want to start with? The Gott und Blandat or the Scum? Scum. I want to try the scum. Okay, let's try the Surt Scum. That's what it says on the back here. And the candy people. Let's see if I can open this. Take a whiff. Right. Yeah. What? It tastes sour. It smells sour. Taste oh, maybe that's what, maybe it's sour, not sweet. Maybe it's sour. Yeah, I guess it's sour scum. So here's what the scum looks like. It's a uh, there's different colors. Pretty soft. Yeah, there's different colors. It's pretty soft. Yellow. And yeah, I think it is going to be sour rather than sweet. Uh, what color do you guys want? Yellow. Uh, I'll guess I'll have pink. That's okay. good. Try them out. I'll try green. Mm. It reminds me of Spain because they had a ton of sour. this kind of candy. Mm. And you would fill up a bag of all the candies that were just like... You like it though? Yeah. Okay. Sour, but sweet. Too sour for this one. 
It's one oh, like I said. Sweet too. I think it's um. I like it. I think it's really good. I mean, it's kind of like Sour Patch Kids. It's mm. definitely it definitely gives you a sour. Well, uh, they're well, definitely sour, not sweet. Well, um, it's different. Th I think it's less sour than Sour Patch Kids. Like, but it's that kind scum. of a that kind of thing. That's what you get to expect. Not don't expect sweetness, which obviously if you could read Swedish, you would uh, know not to. But but I like these, uh, and they're easier to eat than the uh, the Yule Scum was. More? All right. More? Let's not overdo any of these because we have a bunch to uh, get through. All right. So that was the Surt Scum. And next is the Salt Scum. And some water so you guys want to cleanse your palates. This should be a little bit more fun. Um, more of an adventure. And it's interesting to see what kids think of these. Well, even one of these kids doesn't have a cold, so... Could you taste the uh, sourness of those things? Yeah, it's a tiny bit. What does it smell like? It smells. That smell like. No. Yeah. This smells exactly like uh, black licorice, which is I know that's a popular thing in Sweden. And um, see, the scum itself is is the same. It's it's very uh, pillowy. It's very soft. And uh, here you go. Thank you. Not popular. Not even not even with the one who can't can't really taste anything. I didn't even Did eat it. Did you take it. a bite? I didn't even eat doing? it and I didn't like it. You just, okay, one of them, one of them didn't eat it and didn't like it. I said, she didn't, she does have a bite. I ate it. But I guess she put it back. Uh, the other one took a lick. Let me see here. The other one ate, <laughs> she ate this much of it and don't like it? Not popular. Okay, there you go. Uh, I didn't get a chance to try it yet, but it's not very popular so far. Hmm. It doesn't skimp on the taste. It is like black licorice, but with the salt. And I've had, I've heard these are extremely strong. They're not extremely strong, but they're just like I don't know. They don't really have too much of a taste to it. That might just be me, though. I think it's you. It definitely has has a lot of flavor. I don't hate it. Um, I saw something I think I would buy on my own. But it um, it's it's definitely not a boring candy. It has a lot. Wow, that was actually stronger. Mm, I was going to say it wasn't that strong, but... Whoa! Mm. That one's a lot stronger. Maybe I don't like it. <laughs> I was going to say that basically it tastes like uh, black licorice, but salty, and I didn't think it was that bad at first, but that second one was a lot stronger. Um, yeah, I think... Uh, what do you think, girls? Thumbs up? Thumbs down? Mm. Yeah, not too surprising from Americans. As far as I know, this is a pretty... even over of Swedish heritage. Uh, uh, these are uh, quite the delicacy in... Uh... No, no, put it back in. So uh, this was uh, yeah, probably kind of thumbs medium, right? Yeah. I really liked it. I like this much. Uh, okay, right, they were both thumbs up on that, especially compared to this, oh, right? I, like this. I know that's what I said. This one, but especially compared to this one, right? Wow. These are really thumbs so up. Both of them were just like that. Which one did I? Like this. Yeah, I know, but you didn't like this. Yeah. Okay, well that's the scum. Now let's try the gotten blandet. Oh. Taste. Alright, these look a little bit more like uh, licorice. Let's see the shapes they got. Uh oh, of course, Swedish fish. This is Swedish a sailboat. Fish? Oh, that's neat. That's a sailboat. Yeah. yeah. Black yeah. Sailboat. Like a little sail. This is just like a little, it's like a little present or something. This is more like licorice. Yeah, some little tubes. These are neat. This is black licorice. This might be better. This is like black licorice without the salt. I'm gonna try this one first. Hawaii. I'm not sure, just a little square. Alright, pick one and try it. Oh, ah! One? It's a pineapple. I can't chew it. Which one you got? Alright, we both look at the black one. Yeah, that's Sweet. very, 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 very chewy. I can't. It tastes like Swedish fish. Alright, the red one tastes like Swedish fish, which is good. Um, oh, there's another orange one. I'll too. try a sailboat. So these must be uh, fruit flavored ones. This is like. I don't know if it's an orange or a peach. What's there? Yeah, that black one is uh, very hard to chew. Oh, the silver's good. What did it taste like? Um, it tasted more like the first than the other one did. Alright, yeah. The black ones are really hard to really hard to chew. The other ones are easier. They stick to your teeth, but at least you can chew them. I like a Swedish fish. Did it taste like regular Swedish fish? Uh-huh. That was good. Yeah, and that pineapple one definitely tastes like pineapple. Let me try the uh, orange one. 
Yep. Good orange flavor. So the ones that... Oh, what are these? Oh! Here we've got a little car. This is oh. a little tiki. More stuff. This is a tiki. Car. Do you see the face? Oh, yeah. It's we've a, got a little puppy. Yeah, a poodle here. A good old poodle. Wait, can I see? Okay. There's a bunch of things. Yeah, this is a weird little face thing. Let's see if this is a... Hmm. Got a little orange peel. Mm, did you try this one? Nope. I think it's lemon. Which is uh, this one's favorite flavor. You should try this. She's a lemon. I know. And, um, oh, what's this one? There's another one I haven't seen. A leaf? Could this be like mint? Try it. Try it. Try the little raspberry. Oh, yeah, that's a puppy. Hmm. Oh, I don't try know. this. I don't know, it's green, but I don't know what that leaf one is. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, every time we pull more out, there's more things. There's a lot of different things in here. We did good. Peach? Mm, it looks I like peach. I tried. Let me see what the, uh, the car is. I'm guessing it's black licorice again. But... Pineapple. Tastes like a Honda. Yeah, a little bit. Yeah. Is this a flower? Mm, that one's stronger than the uh, cube ones. Just as hard to eat, but it kind of tastes like the salt one. Somehow. This is, this is how I eat, but it basically just tastes like black licorice, but the car is a lot stronger. Any so, other shapes we missed? I, didn't, I never tried a square one. Swim, 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 swim. Sure. So, I tried this. It's more chewy than the black ones you've got here. Mm -hmm. um, and really? it has more of a flavor, too. And it doesn't stick to your teeth as much, though. I don't think it's more chewy, is it? I mean, it's... Well, this, I, don't, I haven't had really much of my life chewier than this thing. Try it this way. Oh, yeah. Fish. I, didn't, I didn't try fish it yet. It tastes good. It's, you it's try not, fish? It tastes like the same exact thing, but not really. That's well, something we kind of know what to expect. Ah, that was good. Uh, oh. Yeah, merch variety. <laughs> You've got a cat and a oh, dog here. Oh. Wait, can I see the cat? Oh, even more stuff. I'm guessing those probably taste like the car. Oh, what's this? A triangle. Oh, the sailboat. Yeah, we did see that. <gasps> I thought it was a piece of pizza. <laughs> <laughs> what's this? A triangle? Pizza? Bird pizza. All right, so it's definitely uh, quite the variety in there. What else we missed? Swedish fish? But to be honest, what's if this? this was, um, oh. You think uh, this is like a passion fruit or a... I'm not sure what that is. It looks like an orange, but it's red. Want to try it? That's probably yeah. an apple. Hmm. Cats and dogs. Mm -hmm. Yeah, if they she took the. Uh... Mm -hmm. Oh, well, that would make sense. Tastes like pomegranate. Hmm. Yeah. Well, All right. So I think. Uh, what did you guys think of these? Good. I think it was good. All right. Uh, except for the. Did it? You tried the uh, the black licorice one, right? Okay. What did you think of that? Yeah, it was kind of hard to chew, but. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, that's the best. I, I think uh, personally, if I. Uh, if they had this without the black licorice, I'd be really like this and the whole thing. Which brings us to... Mm-hmm. I have a feeling these aren't going to be as popular as the girls. But it's another... As you can see, we've liked so far, we have liked these two. Because these ones are more taste, and these ones are both salt, so I'm not sure that I'm going to be these ones. Okay, <laughs> Ooh, look at this. Ooh. What the heck are these? I might have got it, some more it looks licorice. like a uh, it looks like a pepper. I'm not sure what that is. Some kind of a. I may have. Ooh, you know, we got the clam. We, got, we got the tubes, but they're covered in salt. I may have. It's like shells. Yeah, it's kind of oh, odd. Oh, sorry. Odd thing for a candy. To, there's different colored oh, wait, ones. Uh, this, this is, is a pepper. A sea star. Darker and lighter. Sea star. This is a um, bigger, larger. Here's sea another. Star. Look, they have different sizes of sea stars, as you can see. And then it's just trying to. You've got a mommy, you've got a papa, and you got a baby. Maybe it might just be stars, maybe not sea stars, because they also have triangles. Uh, I don't know. Well, I'm going to try I'm gonna try a star. And there's the... Whoa! What? Yeah, try these out. Oh, you don't oh, want no. in there. I'm trying the star, okay. baby star. Mm -hmm. Oh, thank you. There's a triangle? Mm-hmm. Oh, uh, 
Can somebody try the pepper? I got one here. I haven't tried it yet. <laughs> go, dad. Go, dad. Go, dad. Oh God! Black. Probably, but no, this this isn't really. I think it's an acquired taste. Try some more. This one, this one over here, the little one does not like a star, and all she did was have a little, a little lick of the salt part. <laughs> but I gotta try one of these, whatever it is, pepper or whatever it is. Whoa! Easier to eat than the black ones. Hmm, not quite as strong. But um, it's not a pleasant flavor. These aren't. These aren't definitely not sweet snacks. There are sweet snacks and there are savory snacks, or salty snacks, and this goes under the category of salty ones. But they're uh, hmm, not very pleasing to me or the little ones. I don't think. Right? Yeah. Can I have one of these to get? The yeah, taste sure. Mm. <laughs> yeah. What did you think of it? Um, wasn't so good. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna have another one of these. Get rid of that taste. Uh, oh. What well, I don't notice these have S's on them. They do. They have what? Yeah. Can I see? An S on it. And it actually says S right here, so that probably means I already have one. All right, now that leaves us with a couple things, but let's uh, try out these uh, variety things here. Okay. All right, we got tons of stuff in here. Oh, there's Coke bottle. Yeah, uh, pick something and try it out. Let us know what you think. I'm gonna try this Marianne thing. What is that one? Oh, so got hard. I'll try Coke. Hmm. This thing has a hard shell, and like a minty, uh, I think maybe the shell's minty. It's kind of like chocolate inside. Let me see if I can break one open. All right, what do you think of what you're eating before you pick up other things? So I'm confused everybody. I'm um, guessing this is like chocolatey, so I'm gonna try it out. This is the inside of the uh, Marianne. I eat this one. What do you think of the Coke powder? It was pretty good. Can you taste this white stuff that's on it? Is it like a cream? No, yeah. no this tastes Coke. There's also some jello in it. Where? Hmm. Interesting. Chocolate. No, oh, very yeah. stretchy. Hmm. Not a lot of flavor in that. It's kind of. Yep, my guess is right. It is chocolatey. It's more chewy than flavory. Very chewy. Well, I guess I'll put them in there, too. There's the dame. Yeah, these, we've actually had these Can before. Can I eat this one again? Can I eat this one? Sure. Sure. See if it's any different than the, than the bottle. So, um, this is the dame. Mm hmm The dame. And mm. there's, like, two layers inside. It kind of like reminds me of a Heath bar because like there's like a kind of thing. yeah, because there's like a peanut butter inside sort of, and it's like a chocolate coating on the outside. There. Let's try one of those two, but let me try a Kex first. We've had these before. We get these from that Swedish uh, thing that we went to holiday thing. Chocolate. Yeah, I think it's uh, the wafers. Oh, that's not bad. That's a. Uh, a pretty uh, familiar kind of thing. I think the age is showing us on us a little bit. It has a little bit of a stale kind of taste to it, but um, really good chocolate and wafers. You want to try it? No. No? Oh, that's right. This one doesn't like chocolate. I didn't, uh, I didn't bite it. I took it. Oh, I, I actually, when I, I, was like, getting, when I was getting stuff ready, I tried one of these, and these are, these are pretty good. I like the um, jello. Yeah? It it's like a little, it's like a jello. You're right. It's like a jello mold. Jello y. Is it? A lot. Tastes like jello? Yeah, there's tons of flavor on these ones with the, the white on the back. A little pineapple-y. Mm. Uh, let's see. Bounty. I'm wondering if this has like coconut, like our... Uh... Has anybody tried this yet? Which one? This. The big ball? No. Let's see, there's a chocolate-covered something. Let's see what it's chocolate-covering of. Yeah, <laughs> of course. 
It's coconut. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. No, not my favorite thing. But it's good. It tastes like an almond joy. Same thing. Or mine's. Like it's, it's funny. Just by the look of it, you can kind of tell. So, this is not cream. Like some sort of nut. I'm guessing it's chocolate. And, yeah, so I'm going to try that. Like cream. Not the cream original. And my predictions are right. What's that? That it's like a chocolate ball. Mm, well, you kind of what's inside. There's like this like yummy peanut creamy butter. peanut butter inside. Is that peanut butter? It's a perfect mix because the chocolate sort of melts in your mouth. That is like biting into a peanut butter cup, but without like without having to get pieces stuck in your tongue because of the like. It sounds like it's good though. Huh? <laughs> this one. Unfortunately, I think it gets stale. It's I can't I can't bite it. I actually can't bite into it, so I took a little bit off the end. But it has a, a peach flavor, so this seems to be like a, uh, a fruit. I'm guessing maybe different kinds of fruit, like peach and you know, orange or something. And uh, that's on the sweet side. It seems like it'll be good, but unfortunately, I uh, I let it get too stale. And let's see, we have some more black licorice stuff. Anybody want to try those? Looks like we have the salt yep. and the non-salt. Oh yeah, you don't want to try those. It's it's really hard. Mm, this one's also incredibly chewy. Actually, that might actually be sugar on it instead of salt. That doesn't taste so salty. Wow. Uh, so. I'm getting full on candy. I think, uh, yeah, girls are actually getting full on candy. That's a weird, weird thing to happen. So let me just try the last couple of things. Oh, it's a geisha. A what? A geisha. But I'm guessing it's not, not Japanese. So this is another chocolate covered something. Seems to be chocolate covered. Chocolate. Mmm. I don't know if got cream chocolate inside. It's like a fudge. That's good. Do you want to try one of these? No, this is kind of like a caramel. I did try one when I was getting the stuff ready. Yeah, I never thought this would happen, but apparently the girls have gotten tired of, of sweets. I only ate two pieces. What? Literally. I ate yeah. two pieces. This one's good. Almost like a, uh, there's a caramel flavor, but it's almost more like a, uh, a nougat in its texture. Alright, we may not be getting everything, but this is taking quite a while. We got most of the stuff, and this, these, uh, oh, is a different colored, uh, one of these, um, jello molds. So there's the one that we, uh, had tried, and it's a different colored one. It's got kind of like a pink, uh, cream on it. But I think, uh, I think we've had kind of enough. Most of the stuff is good. The, uh, unfortunately, some of these things were in here too long, and... And they got uh, a bit on the stale side. Um, sorry about that. Mostly sorry to the uh, the Magnus. Um, let's see. Okay, I'm sure most of this. But there is one more thing, girls. Did you realize we left out one thing? Yeah, mm -hmm. the chocolate. Yeah, the thing is probably going to be the most popular thing, although one of these girls isn't a big chocolate fan. It's milk chocolate. What? Oh, <laughs> oh in that case. She doesn't really like the chocolate. See what this is like and how it's uh, how it survived. Nice. It smells like milk chocolate. Looks like milk chocolate. And it tastes like milk chocolate. Yeah, that's chocolate. Yeah. Thank you. Mmm, it's delicious. Very much recommended. Yeah, that's just fine. It's nice to have something uh, familiar after some of the uh, some of the weird things. It's just chocolate, which is great. What do you think? Um, in the middle, kind in the middle, of. In the middle because it's chocolate, but it's good though, right? Mm -hmm. So overall, uh, I just want to say a huge thank you to Magnus for sending this and all the other stuff. And we still have the uh, review of this coming up and one other item, which um, you saw the original video, you know, but it is something pretty scary. But um, yeah, this was um, a lot of good stuff. Uh, just uh, some of the uh, the salt things are kind of, I think, an acquired taste, so they didn't they weren't really have a huge hit with us. Sour stuff was a little on the strong side, but still quite good. And almost everything else was really tasty. It was, just, it was just candy. It was good stuff. So thank you again to the Magnus, and thank you for watching, and goodbye. Or adjo.